filming a video about lipsticks, and of course I have lipstick on my teeth. Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Andrea, and today I'm going to do a beauty video, which is a shocker, because I'm aware it's been a while. And yeah, this one's going to be all about the lippy products. Some of my favorite lip products, these go from like drugstore to high end. A little diverse, so there's like a little bit of everything that anyone can get their hands on. I'm really excited about these, but I feel like at the same time, they're all kind of the same because I'm usually wearing the same kind of lip. I don't really change into colors that much. This is kind of like my top five lipsticks, but I kind of only have four lipsticks, one lip balm, and two lip glosses. So hopefully this video comes out a little okay. Starting off with my favorite lip balm. I've tried a bunch of lip balms. This is just like a clear lip balm, no color to it. Something to moisturize your lips. Mine's a little clunky and a little dirty. I did take this to the beach and it did get a little dirty with sand. There's like sand on it, which is just, it makes me look so ghetto for still having this, but I don't even care. It is the Baby Lips Doctor Rescue Collection in the mint color. It's a menthol favored one. Medicated lip balm, like I don't even know. I really like it, like it also says to keep away from the rich children. I only have that much left. I need to go buy another one. This baby is always in my purse. I love having it for like amusement parks. I feel like amusement parks is like where your lips just kind of explode and it just, they get a little crusty. So I always have this bad boy in my purse. Anywhere I go, it always travels with me, and I need to go get another one as soon as possible. But it honestly is the best one, so it's just the plain one. It's in too cool, and too cool. It's my favorite one. I am obsessed with all the baby lips. I collect them because I think they look cute in my little makeup thing. But this is actually the one that I reach for the rest of them. They're all high because I don't even go near them. But this one's my favorite, as you can tell. The U.S. lip balms are really good too, but I just feel like this baby is so much more moisturized. I feel like the lip balm, like, uh, uh, and it's just like sticky. But this is just so subtle, and I really do like this. We're gonna go with lip gloss. I have two lip glosses. They are both high end. So sorry, I'm really not one to wear lip glosses. So the first one is the Naked Urban Decay lip gloss, and I love this one. I like the difference of this on under a lipstick. This lip gloss has done wonders for me. I just really like that color. Oh, should I swatch this? Since I couldn't swatch the first one. Let's watch this bad boy. If you guys can see that because of my lights. This is in Sesso. I don't know, but I really like it and it's from Urban Decay. Next for lip gloss, this is one that I've had for a little bit and I've always liked it. This lip gloss, it's probably one of the first lip glosses that I've gotten. I really purchased it. And it honestly reminds me of my dad because my dad was actually the first person to buy me this lip gloss. My dad whenever he would go like on business trips and things like that and my mom, they would always bring something back and one day my dad, I asked him for makeup. And like, how do you send your dad to go buy makeup? Especially for a little girl who doesn't wear makeup. So he got me a Dior lip gloss, and ever since that time that he got it for me, I loved it. It's really pink, and I really like it. I don't really wear it much anymore, but it's honestly my favorite. It may just be the sentimental value of it, but it honestly is a really nice pink little color. If you guys can see that, it's the one that I just touched, really. I'm not good at this stuff. And it's in red curtain, and I just love it. And it's Dior, Christian Dior, I don't know. It's honestly my favorite pink lip gloss. They probably have changed the packaging on this one because I have had this one for a while since I don't wear lip gloss anymore. Coming in in fourth place would be a Tarte lip product, which is the Tarte Lip Surgeon in a Divine Shimmer to it. It's right next to the lip gloss. You guys can probably not see it. I don't know if you guys are seeing these well. It's that one closest to me. I really like this. It's so tiny. It's so convenient to take everywhere. I definitely want to try more of these Tarte ones because this is the only one that I've tried. And, I don't know, I really like these lip surgeons, so I'm like, I want to try more of these because that color is just me. Coming in third place is another one kind of like that one that's a little more glossy. The last two are matte. Maybelline Hooked on Pink Lipstick, which is this last color right here. You guys may have seen my haul that I did when I got set my stuff when Maybelline and Style Haul were working together for their show Vanity. So this was sent to me then, but I loved it. I, like, I'm always honest with you guys, so I don't want you guys to think that like, just because something was in this pile of stuff that I picked when this finishes, I will definitely be repurchasing this on my own because I just, I love that. Coming in second place is this Revlon Color Stay Ultimate Suede Color in Supermodel. That's a beautiful name for that, which is the color that is right here on the bottom. I love this color. It's a very nice mauvey, purpley, pinky color. I love that color. It's just such a beautiful color. love the matte to it, but it has like, it's very moisturizing for it being a matte one, for it being drugstore brand. Coming in, and number one is probably no surprise to anyone. It is Velvet Teddy from MAC, and yeah, um, it's honestly my favorite. I'm going to swatch it up here. Velvet Teddy is the one on top right here. I don't know. I am obsessed with Velvet Teddy. It's my favorite one. It is one of their popular lipsticks. It's always out. Like, I try to buy it like three times and they were out. Velvet Teddy is my favorite lipstick right now. I love it. It's really nudie, 
but with like a dark tint to it. I don't even know how to describe lipsticks. They're all kind of the same family members, but not. None of them are the exact same thing. And I really am into like the pinky nudes. I don't know why. They're my favorite ones. And I think it's just kind of like the season that we're in right now. Like summery, going into fall. I don't know. Are we going into fall? It's August now. When does summer end? I don't know. Oh, that works with I hope it made sense for you guys. I just want to share my favorite lip products without like getting too into it. I don't really know how to describe lipsticks from what I see. I think I just called everything really pretty and really awesome. It's kind of my thing and I really loved it. That's what I probably said about everything. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will talk to you guys in the next one. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you guys liked it. Comment below any video ideas. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's free and it notifies you when I upload a new video. And I don't know, let's try to make it a goal to get to 2,000. I think that'd be really cool and really awesome. Yeah, it honestly means a lot when you guys subscribe and just comment and interact with me. It's just amazing. Also, follow me on all my social media, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat. I Snapchat every day. I'm guilty. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye, everyone.